So a couple of things I've noticed about CPAC. Um, conservatives at these conventions don't waste an awful lot of time talking about ideas or policy. You know, you don't find people say, here's an idea for how we could solve this problem, or here's an idea of how we could solve that problem, or a policy change we could tweak, or, you know, there's none of that going on. Absolutely. When conservatives get together at a convention, the only thing they do there is talk smack about the opposition. They send their cheerleaders up to talk in front of an audience where they just talk smack and talk trash about the opposition. That's all they do. You know, conservatives don't have any new ideas. In fact, they don't believe in new ideas. They think that the old time-tested ideas are the ones that are the best. The time-tested ideas that brought America to its greatness, of course, are the ones that they want to go with. And none of them are new. No new ideas under the sun for conservatives. All right. It's all they want to go with all the tested ideas. And all these ideas have been thoroughly tested and brought America to its greatness. Well, their perspective on history is very warped. They completely discount huge sections of history, like the labor movement in this country, like the civil rights movement in this country. These progressive movements and how they shaped this country and brought it to greatness, they completely discount. They just want to rule that out categorically. It doesn't exist for them. It doesn't appear on their radar in American history. They just don't see it, refuse to see it. The other thing that's missing is any discussion about corporations at all, about the collusion that is currently going on between government and corporations, between lobbyists and congressmen. The revolving door, going from being a lobbyist and running for office to being a congressman and trying and getting hired by a lobbying firm. That sort of stuff never gets mentioned at all, okay? Reigning in the power of corporations to influence government, special interests, is something conservatives never discuss. It's, it's not on their radar at all. They talk about big government and the American people. Big government, bad. American people, good, all right? That's all they want to talk about. It's just this, you know, the other entities that influence politics, they don't want to discuss at all. They don't want to talk about corporations. You know why? You know why? It's because they are leading the charge when it comes to the collusion of corporations and government, all right? So they want to lump corporations in with the American people. And that's something they will never admit, okay? They'll never even talk about it. So for them, corporations are just a manifestation of the American people. So when they obey the will of corporations, they're obeying the will of the American people. <laughs> and this whole incestuous cycle of going from lobbyist to Congress, lobby to Congress, is just something they see as completely, completely okay. They don't see any problem with it at all, all right? So that's, that's a dirty little secret, all right? So Republicans, the only thing they can do is, is talk trash, talk trash about liberals. They have no new ideas about anything. They like the old ideas, but their perspective on history is warped. And they will never talk about corporate power and undue corporate influence in American politics because they are the ones behind it. So anyways, that's all for now.